y'all. This woman. This woman. I'm shook right now. Hello and welcome to Hair by Shonda TV. In today's video, I am going to do a sew in with natural leave out. As you can see, her hair is a little bit short. We've been growing it though. The first time she came to me, it was really, really short, like tapered in the back. So this is my second sew in I am installing on her. I just wanna get her ends trimmed real quick so I can start the braiding process. As you can see, I'm adding a little bit of braiding hair to her first braid right at the edge, just so that it can um, have a little bit of strength to it, if that makes sense, uh, because her hair is short and it's a little bit thin. So I want to um, make it a little bit fuller. So when I start sewing that hair on, it won't pull on her hair so much.
Before I apply the net and the hair extensions, I want to add a little bit of Strand Builder Leave-In Conditioner by Castly Hair Care System. You can find that on saloncast.com as well. So I'm just going to spray it in her hair just so that her hair can be nice and healthy and get a lot of vitamins and nourishment while it's underneath the sew-in. So while we were sitting there talking at the last minute, we decided to add in some peekaboo highlights in the front of her hair. And we're just kind of going with whatever color this turns out to be. <laughs> I had a blonde strip of hair that was left over from a previous sew-in. And so I'm putting it in this Adore African Violet and I'm gonna let it sit until I'm finished with her sew-in. So it's, an, it's a mystery color. We'll see, we'll see how it turns out. So we are using Salon Cast hair. Uh, this is two and a half bundles of 18 inch hair that she used in her previous sew-in. This is really good hair. It can be reused over and over again. And we didn't cut it into any kind of style. Like we didn't put any layers or anything in it last time I installed it because we wanted to keep it all the same length so that it wouldn't be a hassle to reinstall this time around. So. We want to, you know, keep it all the same length. It's all 18. And we're going to use it for a third time and a fourth time and a fifth time. <laughs> because the hair is that good. Oh Lord, here's the hair. So it's like a bluish, blondish, grayish, bluish color. It's like tie dye. <laughs> uh, I look, I was like, mm, I don't know if she's gonna like this, but then I showed it to her and she was like, it's cute. <laughs> So, and it actually did turn out cute. You know, wet hair versus dry hair is a whole different story. So, after it was dry and it was um, blended in with the darker hair, it really did look cute. I thought it looked cute. So I'm getting ready to apply a little bit of Total Perfection Beeswax from Castly Hair Care to her hair because we need to seal these cuticles, girl. We need to seal these cuticles on her hair. You see how short it is? I want it to blend so good. And that wax is gonna melt her hair and the extensions together in a perfect union. Perfect, perfect, perfect. Okay, because baby girl got natural hair on those edges. I need to lay it down, honey, with this Castly Hair Care Moroccan Texturing Cream. It's a light edge control, and I'm just going to rub it on and set it for her 
so that her edges will look real fleeky. <laughs> Do people still say edges on fleek? <laughs> oh, God. Well, that's what they're going to look like. <laughs> no, they'll lay down really nice and smooth, though, for her. Edges are coming along pretty good for this 4C hair. No relaxer, nothing. All we did was apply the edge control. And I have to massage and rub it in because I want it to every strand to get straight. So I'm going to add a rapid strip and set it while I curl it. So now we're almost finished. I'm just going to spray it down with a little bit of Hold It Curling Spritz by Castle Hair Care. It doesn't make the hair really hard. It allows your hair to hold a tight curl while still offering a soft touch. You know, it, it, it holds the curl, but you still move your fingers through it and all that stuff. Your hair is still movable. Okay, all finished curling and we're gonna let them sit and cool so they can set. <laughs> we're celebrating that we're done. <laughs> we are all done. Well, not all done, but almost done, almost done. So I'm gonna take these pins out or these duckbill clips out and start to shape her hair.
sweetheart. No. Rip. Oh, my gosh, Shonda. What am I supposed to do with you? Just, you know, you know. You know. You know. Um, y'all tripping, y'all about to see my face. I don't care.